You ever wonder why Scorpion is yellow? Maybe not, but I know you're at least a little bit curious since you clicked on the video, right? Well then good news, because I'm here to explain why Ed Boon's favorite ninja decided to don his yellow dreads. Now, I know what you're thinking. He's made of fire, right? So, yellow? But no, that's actually not why. I mean, yeah, you could assume that because, you know, Sub-Zero's blue because of the ice, Reptile is, is green because most lizards are green. That's actually not true. A lot of reptiles can change color based on mood or to blend in their environment, which is why you have Chameleon, which was kind of cool for a bit, but nobody even knows about that character. Anyway, that's not why Scorpion's yellow, okay? This video will be two minutes long if that was the reason, and luckily it's not, that way it can be longer. Now the second thing you're probably thinking is, but underdog, isn't yellow the color of the Shirai Ryu? Just like the Lin Kuei are all blue? No! You're wrong on both points. Until Mortal Kombat X, nobody had ever even seen the Shirai Ryu. Since, you know, they're all dead. Well, they were all dead. Your inferior clan is dead. Soon you will join them. My clan may walk the earth once more. Plus, the newest members only wear yellow because they're all led by Scorpion. He's their leader and founder, so it makes sense that they would don his colors. The same goes for the new Lin Kuei members as well. Because before the events of MK9, the Lin Kuei dressed in whatever colors they felt like. Cyrax was yellow, Sector was red, and Smoke was gray, which isn't even a color in my opinion. In fact, most of them were gray, and then they were all gray after the Grand Master decided to turn them all into robots. Seriously, look how mundane and boring they all look. What an asshole. Took away all their expressive colors. Now, Sub-Zero obviously wore blue because he's a cryomancer. That is, he manipulates ice. Hell, he even got to stay blue after he was cyberized. In fact, so did Sector and Cyrax. What's up with that? Anyway, in order to find out why Scorpion is yellow, we need to go way back. Back to the earliest events of the series, and by earliest, I mean the reboot. Scorpion was killed. We know that. However, a huge misconception is that he was killed by Sub-Zero. That is, Bi-Han, who is the older brother of the two Sub-Zeros. This actually was not the case. Scorpion wasn't even aware what Sub-Zero looked like during the first tournament. Don't believe me? Then just look at this clip. They're in the same damn room, and neither one even gives the other a passing glance. If Sub-Zero had killed Scorpion, then a fight surely would have broken out right then and there. Because Sub-Zero is prideful, and Scorpion, th the dude's just batshit crazy. I mean, he's died. I'd probably be crazy too if I had been murdered. However, the fact that nothing happened proves that Scorpion wasn't killed by Sub-Zero. So he has no idea what Sub-Zero even looks like. He just knows his code name. What Scorpion does know, or at least he thinks he knows, is that Sub-Zero murdered his family and his entire clan. However, that's also not true. Quan Chi actually did all those things, so Scorpion is literally serving the man who killed his entire culture. See, this is why I never preferred Scorpion. The guy's an idiot. Even in the newest game, he's still a bit of an idiot. I will have Quan Chi. We have things under control. You can- He must die. Raiden needs him. Without Quan Chi, we can't restore Liu Kang and the other revenants. You'd leave them trapped? Like you were? Only Quan Chi concerns me. Seriously, what a short-sighted asshole. I mean, come on. It's called Foresight, Hanzo? Foresight? You, you ever heard of it? You ever, you ever ring a bell? So, we know that Scorpion was killed, and that his family was then supposedly murdered by a ninja of the Lin Kuei, known as Sub-Zero. Now, pay close attention to how these ninjas look, okay? Notice their attire. They all dress in a similar style, just with different colors. They're palette swaps, basically. Knowing this, Scorpion purposely dresses just like they do. With the whole V-cut and the ropes and the straps and all that good stuff. However, he chooses the color yellow to mock Sub-Zero and, by extension, his entire clan. Calling them out as cowards, since that is what the color yellow represents. So he's literally walking up to the person who murdered his family, who was basically defenseless. It was his wife and a young boy, and he's calling that ninja out as being a coward by dressing like him, but in the color yellow. This was actually stated in the original Mortal Kombat games. Scorpion purposely dresses like Sub-Zero, but then changes the color to yellow in order to mock him. However, since it's obvious that Scorpion doesn't know what Sub-Zero looks like specifically, he does know how the Lin Kuei typically like to dress. So he kind of just made a guess on his new wardrobe choice. This really doesn't come up much in the new games though. What a shame. At any rate, dogs, 
That concludes this video on why Scorpion is yellow. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. Also, I am selling t-shirts for $30 and $40, depending on which color you want, which is basically either white for the $30 or any other color for $40. So if you want one, go ahead and email me at underdoggaming at gmail.com. I'll put the link on screen. As always, guys, come back next time and stay underdogs.